Two baseballs are thrown from the roof of a house with the same initial speed. One is thrown up and the other is down. Compare the speeds of the baseballs just before they hit the ground. To answer this question, think of it just in general. So if this is the roof of our house and we throw a ball straight up, it will follow a path or trajectory that is parabolic until it falls and hits the ground. So here's our ground and here's our house. So if this ball goes up with an initial velocity of V0 shown here, when it returns to the same height above the house, it will have the same initial velocity pointed downwards. Now, the other ball that is thrown down, is thrown down with the same initial speed of V0. You can see here that after some time, the ball thrown up will be pointed down with the same initial velocity at as which ball 2 was thrown down, but at a later time. So ball 1 will, that is thrown down will strike first, while the second ball that was thrown up will reach the ground later. However, since they both have the same velocity pointed down at this height, they're both going to have the same velocity when they reach the ground level. So they'll both have a speed of v because v squared is equal to v naught squared plus 2a delta x. For both of them, a is the same. Delta x is the same height that they're going to fall. They both have the same initial velocity. Therefore, their final velocities will be the same. So the answer for this question would be C. They both move with the same speed before they strike the ground. Once again, the ball thrown down will reach the ground first, but the ball that's thrown up will still have the same velocity, but it will just be in the air longer. So once again, the answer is C. They're both moving with the same speed once they are about to hit the ground.